Hi everyone, this is Saga Prison Story. Welcome back to our YouTube channel. My name is Robin. And I am Saga. Yes. Or Grace. Or call me the name you like. Welcome back to our channel. Yeah. We are again with my friend Robin. Today we are in a park. And it is uh, the weather is good. What yeah, is today is the weather is good. We, we have thank come God. to take a walk yeah. in this park. God yes. is good. And then, Robbie, you know, I've just remembered. You yes. see that road? Yes, I can you see, see it. it. Yes. Yes. You can see the road very well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can see it. The other day, mm. how many months ago was it? Can you remember how many months? It's ago? like uh, almost three months, I think. Yes, three yeah. months ago. Yeah. Yes. Hey, there was a very funny incident on that. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. You know what happened? No, I I was not there, but I can remember that it was all over in the media. And then I was really, really, really shocked. Yes. You remember? Yes. Yes. It was so, so, such a mm -hmm. harrowing experience. Yes. Guys, what happened is there is a, a it, the story went like this. I think it was a mother, a son. A brother and a father and a father mm -hmm. so it's like they had quarreled and the house their house mm -hmm. is also not very far from this road yeah there. it is not i think it's somewhere so, i think behind it's across that bus. the road up behind yeah. the bus yes, yes yeah yes. Behind, that bus. behind that bus yes so i understand they used to live there mm -hmm. and then uh, the a quarrel started from the house they started quarreling from inside the house yes and then it escalated to the the road yeah i don't know how they came out from the house mm. then they went mm. they went and continued quarreling when they were on the on, on the, the road on the road yes Robin, do we sit here yeah, yeah we can sit here we can sit okay here. Mm. yeah so it was so 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 sad because what happened is that this started quarreling and the quarrel had started from home yeah apparently this young man had a gun the son who felt aggravated or who felt that the, the family was against him or something mm. no, no, just this family feuds mm. and uh, the parents were trying to advise him on uh, on the best thing to do it uh, the story went like that though mm. then that day i had gone to a supermarket there's a supermarket we had gone yes. to Fresco. Yeah, just yes. behind here. Yeah. I'd gone to buy some stuff. So as I was coming out of the supermarket, I had gunshots. Man, this thing was just here. I just hear people saying about gunshots. Mm. This time I saw it with my own two eyes. I just had, I think, one, two, three, four, maybe around three to five gunshots, mm. if I remember. It's, it's been a while now, so. And all of a sudden, the, there was somebody lying mm. on the floor. And people were running helter skelter in the supermarket. And do you know, funny thing, in, in Alpha Road, do you know yeah. that place? Yes. You know, there's a police station just opposite there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't know. Fresco. Just there. Imagine, I don't know. Imagine there is just in, uh, you know, from Fresco? Yes. Across the road. Across oh, the road there's like a this. building there. Yes, yes, I normally yes. wonder what is there. I thought it was a fire stone, whatever. No, no. It's oh. police, police. Okay. But you know, even this fire police, mm. when they, whenever there's a problem, they always accompany the. Oh, no wonder. Because I found police. the vehicles there. Yes. Fires in the vehicle. Yes. So I thought maybe it's a fire stone, whatever. Um, mm. And within a very short time, yeah. within a very short time, mm. the whole place was sealed. Yes. Hey, these people are fast. Mm. There were policemen. All of a sudden, the body was covered. Mm. I just couldn't believe that I had seen somebody using that. I was just going to take a bus because you know it is just next to the bus. Yeah. One, two, three minutes. Somebody was alive. Second minute, person is dead. No more. Hey, I was so devastated. I didn't even wait to take the bus because I didn't understand what was happening. Mm. The next taxi that I saw, the first taxi I saw, I saw that guy bed, <laughs> open the door. <laughs> I jumped into the taxi, 
the guy was asking me, where are you going? I just said, just <laughs> let's go. Let's just go. <laughs> but funny enough, I don't live very far from there. So yeah. I was able to reconnect myself when we were out of that, uh, near that uh, yeah. place. And I was able to tell the guy to, to drop me home. Yeah. But you remember, I even left my phone in the car. Yeah, I can remember. I left yeah. my phone there because of that shock. Yes. You know what I saw? One and what happened? And he killed the brother. And the brother the, died. The brother died, and yeah. the mother was in critical condition. Condition. Mm. I feel that she, she, she didn't. Uh, even me too. She didn't lose her life. Mm. So these family things, guys, let us be solving them when there is a problem. Exactly. Talk and let people not. Uh, Overreact because I am sure the boy, wherever he is, mm. he must be. I think he was arrested. And you know, the, the parents didn't know that he has a gun. Yeah, mm. so I think he is regretting yeah. or, 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 wherever he is now for having taken away the life of a beloved family. And we always say, we have previous videos who used to stay as yeah. yeah. So the boy was arrested. happened because I was so devastated mm -hmm. myself. Mm -hmm. I was so shocked for a son to mm -hmm. just kill one of the parents like that. Mm -hmm. It's not easy. It's not easy. Mm -hmm. Then again, Robbie, there's something we wanted to tell our viewers. Mm -hmm. uh, we wanted to tell them about uh, the video we did last time about uh, Lisa. Mambo imebadilika. Mambo imechemuka. Imechemuka Canada. <laughs> Mambo yeah. in yeah. So things have changed. Remember, we had said that. Um, I think we had said that you can come with a visitor's visa. We can even repeat what we said. We said there was a student's visa, visitor's visa. Uh, there was what else? Work permit visa. And then the asylum or refugee claim. Yeah, refugee claim. Now, previously, there, I think in the year two, there's something that happened in Canada during COVID. Yeah. In the year 2020, 2021, those who were here and were not able to travel back home mm -hmm. were allowed to turn their visitors' visas to seek asylum into work permits. Yeah. So they were allowed to look to seek for employment and work. Yes. Because the because of the, the travel no conditions, you know, people could not go, out. people could not come. Mm -hmm. So they were allowed to do that. And I think that this program was supposed to continue until the year 2025. But suddenly a lot of people came in 2023. Mm -hmm. Especially 2023. So many people came. <laughs> and I think um, maybe they were not so prepared because housing you know canada is large very very large mm. but um housing housing mm. is a problem is a problem so what happened is uh, people found themselves here and accommodation was a challenge mm. so they gave they tried they actually tried to yeah. put people in accommodation mm. give them accommodation hotels and shelters mm. but i think the number of people coming in was overwhelming yeah. so they have revisited the, that chance that they had provided. And I think the Prime Minister recently announced that uh, that program is normal. So if you are coming to Canada, let do your due diligence. Check very well. If you are coming as a visitor, just come as a visitor, finish your visiting days and go back home. Because your visa will not be they will not be able to translate it into a work, work uh, permit visa or something or, like that. Or on PR. You will not be able to say, now nah, I want to, to be a citizen. Mm. So when you come, in order for you to be able to stay, you really have to know why you are. Yes. Why you are coming here. Mm. So your story, at, I'm going as a visitor, then I will be able to change my uh, visa into I will be able to be given a work permit is 
Let nobody tell you, let nobody cheat you, let nobody take your money that they are going to assist you. No. Especially Sai, don't allow Kwenda kwa agent. Atu nataka pesa, visa. Atu lipe pesa. Don't do it. Don't do it. So they will send you away from the... From the... Ukifika tu narudishu ya bote. Kwa boda, ukikata kuonyesha why you... You are coming. You are coming. If you cannot really, really prove yourself well, mm -hmm. they will send you back. They are sending many people away. Mm -hmm. So the only way now is through the school. Yeah. You can come as a student. Mm -hmm. you, you can come with a work permit from home, which is very, uh, I You're think, very getting it tough. Is not easy. Unless you are an expatriate. Like in Ukuja too, these are the odd, odd jobs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, so if you are a visitor, you are just a visitor. Yeah. Finish your uh, three months, three weeks. I think maximum is six months. Six months. Yeah. Then you have to go home. Mm -hmm. And then if you are coming as a student as well, mm -hmm. there's a place where they ask you whether you would like to remain in Canada mm -hmm. after you finish school. <laughs> if you want to stay, and <laughs> just and I think I will stay. And then again, that will also raise eyebrows on the other side. But why do you want to stay? Mm -hmm. You know, mm. but it's good to be honest. It's yeah. good to be very honest and say exactly mm. how you want to come. Canada, there is no shortcut. Yeah. For there is no office you will go and uh, bribe. <laughs> yeah, no, no uh, bribing. No bribing. No what? So mm. things will just mm. not work that way. So yeah. we just wanted to correct that mm. because remember we had said that you can come as a visitor. Yes. And then if you want to seek asylum within the six months that you're allowed here, you can do it, but now it's closed. It's mm -hmm. it's yeah. So Ruby, unless there is something you wanna I, add. I think it's only that one because at a CCP I make a challenge kwe to at least you know villa to and kwa nakuja na visitors visa, it was good because we get advice mu to ata nyumbani come. Yes. Tafanya hivi na hivi, but right now vile watu wamefungua, ata si we are sad. Despite sisi tuko huko, but we are still sad also. The only thing that can happen is if you really have a genuine case. Yeah, you have a genuine and you have evidence from home. You have a reason why you want to seek asylum, you have evidence that your story is true. Yeah. Iyo bado hiko. Hiko, iyo bado hiko. Lakini kuja mgeni, ati mbewe huko kwa maeje mpizita, and then another mistake people make, they think that, that when you're here, as a visitor, those six months, ati unaeza fanya kazi. Hakuna. Hey, ni ngumu. Agent ya sikudanganya, atu kifika Canada, ukikawa three days, unapata kazi. Hapo hakuna. Hakuna. There's nothing like that. There is nothing like that. And you cannot work on a visitor's visa. Lazima ichenjiwe. Yeah. Na hiyo kuchewe work permit. Na sasa kuipata ndiyo imekua ngori hiyo. Yeah. So, be advised. Angalia vizuri before you pack your bags and come. Don't be frustrated. There are many people who have gone into depression. Yeah. Because they were promised. You arrive here two days job. Job, yeah. Pesa ni mzuri, yes. They pay well. You can't compare with them. You can't. But there are processes and procedures that you must. Follow. Yeah. Without that, mm -mm. there's no way. Don't be light. Yes. Yeah, so that's it, our friends. That's it. So we are just chilling here with my friend to go to a park. To go to a park. Park, a park. Yeah. Yeah. So don't be light. Yeah. 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 And then people bring their dogs here to play. The dogs, eh? My dog in my place is our dog. Kuna park, kuna park ya umbo pia. Si, kuna park ya umbo pia. Zina kutana, zina kuwa marafiki. Eh, ama zina pigana. Ama zina pigana. They declare violence. Yeah, violence. Yeah. Otherwise, we love you so much. Yes. Bado tunawamis, tafadhali. Buki patana na hii YouTube yetu, tafadhali mwushe. Please share with other people, like, subscribe. We still love you, my people. And Don't comments. forget us. And comment also. Tell us <laughs> what you want us to do. Please. Yeah. We cannot survive. Please, please, please comment. Mm -hmm. what you want us to do or what you want us to improve. 
Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Otherwise, sit and enjoy Jua. Yeah. Until we enjoy the sun. Yeah, we are enjoying the sun today. Yeah, yeah. Because the weather is good. Pretty good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, bye bye. bye. Like, subscribe, yeah. share, comment. Yeah. We love you. Bye. Bye bye.